Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Janisha Shippadonkley. Welcome to Living Healthy, Being Wealthy. Now in today's videos, my friend, we are talking about a shift. And that shift has to do with shifting from a poverty mindset to a wealthy mindset. I'm telling you friends, it is that time, okay? So let me just talk about poverty mindset for a few seconds. So poverty mindset has to do with when you think that nothing works, I cannot go any further in life, you know, this is it, I have to just settle for less, um, I have no money to invest in myself, it's just all the negative thoughts of not moving forward, not walking in your dream and owning up to your responsibilities and it's time to stop that so we are shifting to a wealthy mindset a mindset that we can do all things i can do all things through christ who strengthened me okay i can accomplish everything that i set my mind to and the thing about it also is to have a having a passion for something my because daughter, you can be anything you want to be my son you can be anything you want to be that's not true you can't be anything that you want to be because if you have no passion for it how are you going to do it how are you going to accomplish it you're going to start and you're going to stop so it's time to bring your dreams to life it's time to live it it's time to walk in it and i'm here to help you do so so my friends i want you to reflect on this law and this law applies to almost everything that you do and i'm sure you have heard it before and this law is whatever you sow that you shall reap so my friends my advice to you is to sow thoughts of wealth thoughts of prosperity thoughts of success because i'm telling you if you put two men in a hole right down in a pit you put two men okay and the one with a wealthy mindset, I'm telling you, he will find whatever way it is, whatever it takes him to get out of that pit, I'm telling you, he will get out and he will go back on top. But a man with a poverty mindset, he will say, I can't, it is too hard, okay? I don't have a ladder, I don't have a rope, he has no help to reach up there. So, and then you know what? He will never reach up there because that's the mindset so i am telling you my friends shift to a wealthy mindset one that thinks about prosperity and success and walk into it day by day stop talking down on yourself stop saying i can't afford it i can't afford healthy food to put in my body instead of saying that i can't you know what you need to do start asking yourself how can i grow my income how can i afford this how can I afford healthy food? And you know what people always say? Money don't grow on tree. And so I can't do it. I can't do this. We know. We all know money don't grow on tree. That's true. But how can I grow my income? That is what you should be thinking about, my friends. And once you start to open your mind and open your thinking to stuff like this, you're going to start thinking, what more can I do? What business can I now do to grow my income? What can I do on the side to grow my income? okay and once you start thinking like this you're gonna open up your thoughts so much and you're gonna accomplish so much in this. jealousy jealousy is another sign of a poverty mindset and if jealousy defines you it's really time to evaluate yourself and start to take steps of getting rid of jealousy if you are if you're thinking thoughts like oh that person doesn't deserve it you're jealous of what others have you're jealous of their income you're jealous of them owning business it is time to stop stop tearing down people around you if you go to a city and you see buildings don't try to tear down those buildings my friends try to build your home try to build your home from the foundation right up and let it stand out okay so friends, the system teaches you that you're supposed to get it right the first time. I'm here to tell you, there's nothing wrong with failing. But when you fail, friends, when you fail, you have to rise above it. You have to know that, you know what? What did I do wrong? What can I do better the next time? Don't blame anyone. Just look at the situation, identify it, look at it, evaluate it, and see what you can do better next time that can make this work. Don't make the same mistake again because they say it's nothing wrong with failing. Yes, there's nothing wrong with failing, 
but not failing again because you don't want to go do it the same way and then you fail again so i'm just here to remind you that if you fail evaluate the situation and see what you can do different the next time because failing doesn't make you a failure failing should let you grow grow from your failure rise above them all those tears that you're crying you're going to let all those tears go in vain no use those tears to water what you have sowed so when it's time to harvest when it's time to reap oh my goodness <laughs> your your failure is going to turn in such a joy oh my goodness so listen don't let anyone talk down on you do not talk down on yourself rise to the occasion do it kill that poverty mindset invest in yourself invest in you don't put a price tag on being healthy just do it don't put a price tag of investing in yourself of buying a book to read so you can build your intellectual abilities don't put a price tag on it my friends don't put a price tag on investing in yourself investing in your education to learn to be better don't put a price tag on it remember it is time listen each day think about how you can grow yourself or you can invest in yourself and so you can live a better life okay and that is the shift from a poverty mindset to a wealthy mindset thinking every day of how can i invest into my thing i want you to remember my friends is to be patient be patient and remember that beautiful things takes time okay when you sow something it takes time to grow it takes time to flourish so you're not gonna start a business today and tomorrow you're a millionaire that's not gonna happen it takes time okay and it sometimes it does take failure it takes you looking back and say what can i do different okay i have to evaluate this situation all right and sometimes it takes help so don't be afraid to seek help don't be afraid to ask questions don't be afraid to read don't be afraid to research okay so what business can i do what am i passionate about what business am i passionate about and go after it do it it is your dream and it's time to walk in it turn it turn that dream into wealth so bye friends stay tuned remember like subscribe share the video subscribe tell your sister to subscribe your cousin to subscribe your mom to subscribe your daddy to subscribe okay bye see you soon